So it's uh, Saturday, uh, day of the uh, Dick's Island Paddle Fest battle. Uh, check the uh, marine weather forecast. And it's giving uh, 20 knots southeast, going to 25 knots southeast this afternoon. So the tide's changing uh, just after 2 o'clock. Uh, so that's probably when the wind will increase a little bit. On this island, you've got the, uh, the uh, blackback gull, herring gull, uh, 
cormorants, you probably saw them on the other side, and the eider ducks. The eider duck is the one, uh, the male has the white sort of back. You probably saw a few of them flying around here. And so, so they're um, not that common, so this is a, a great place for them to nest. Uh, their, their eggs often get predated by, um, you know, things like raccoons and that, but there wouldn't be any any animals like that on this one. It was so loud on a calm, calm day, you could just, it was just so noisy, you could just hear them from everywhere, all the houses along there, you just, just amazing, and just flocks of birds everywhere. The birds, because there's no trees left, they, they nest on the ground, a lot of them, and they have these little tunnels everywhere, and little birds running around everywhere, it's kind of, kind of crazy, and, and just uh, pretty smelly too when you get back in there. <laughs> so the, the reason the trees disappeared is because of all of the iguana from the bird, iguana from the birds, right? Very acidic and uh, they killed a lot of the trees. So now there's all sorts of shrubs and uh, uh, you know, ground vegetation. The eider duck has the black belly and the white back. It has a white back, yeah. It's, it's, yeah it's, those are the ones that were uh, the down from a eider duck. Yeah. supposed to be the best down. So yeah. at one point they were almost driven to extinction. That's right. Yeah. From, from harvesting those, yeah. yeah. Uh, last year they yeah, the yeah, the cat as well nest, which is pretty neat. But you often see them in the in the cove there, but they, they nest on the door. Parker and all of this is uh, uh, when I got connected to working with the main to, to do these paddles. Uh, the other party involved is Canoe Kayak New Brunswick, which is the uh, provincial affiliate for they would run like instructional courses on how to sea kayak or river kayak or stand up paddle boards. Um, Canoe Kayak and Brunswick met with the Nature Trust to uh, back in January about getting uh, people more aware of, of, of the reserves. Um, so that's why we're here today and this afternoon. Properties are on on there with uh, usually maps of uh, where they are and a description and uh, um, yeah, it's well laid out.
You might get a practice at assisted rescue. <laughs>